Hi, my name is Aiza Fatma, and I'm the writer and performer of the one-woman show titled Dirty Packy Lingerie. I describe the show as sex, religion, and politics collide as six Pakistani-American women air their dirty lingerie. I don't know about any such thing, but what I do know is you should keep it clean down there. Just wax all the hair. Your husband will like it. I really felt like for a long time that um, in the arts there was a real lack of a voice for um, Muslim females, uh, Muslim American females. And uh, nobody else, you know, is really creating stories about um, this particular population. And uh, when I started writing the show, I didn't really know uh, what I was going to write about. And um, gradually, um, you know, as the show developed, I realized that it wasn't going to be my story. It was going to be stories of these remarkable women that I knew. Hello, assalamu alaikum. My name is Mrs. Cha. I'm calling from New Jersey about your ad in the Urdu Times matrimonial section. Yes, uh, I know he is doctor. <laughs> How much is the boy making? I think the important thing for me is for people to realize that, yes, you can be American and you can be Muslim at the same time. He want a fair skinned girl? <laughs> you know, these days with the makeup, everybody can look fair skinned and she is a very beautiful girl, you know? Um, I say, let the children talk on the email, the tweetering, the book face, then they decide. You know, we are all Pakistani. Our girls don't look like the white girls with the blonde hairs. Um, I've recently had a very interesting experience where um, I performed the show at Fordham, and afterwards there was a girl, a young student, that came up to me. And um, it was very touching. She was like, I had no idea Muslim women could be artists, and I really want to study music, but my parents are not supportive. Um, she, uh, her parents are of Afghani background, and, uh, and she was like, you know, watching you was so inspirational. I'm, I'm going to double major. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to study music, and I'm going to continue to study law. And I think if I just reach one person, then I've done my job.